Uh, welcome back to my channel my sweet and lovely viewers today i want to show you how to start um getting airdrops on nfts using uh, instead of just using social media and um, just wasting data but this one it's an on-chain that's a blockchain social media handle which is owned by um internet computer protocol icp which is popularly known as icp so um I'll be showing you how to create their social media handle right now. So let's go. Let me take you guys to. I already have an account though, but just for the purpose of the tutorial, I will be creating. I already have. I have multiple. Okay, this is from my account. I have multiple ICP wallets. So. I'll be using another one to create the second social media handle. You can see this one. I'll, I'll just drop the link you'll be using for you to. You can see the wallet comes with a, a wallet address. So if you, they are sending you uh, this discovery token, this you it will get to your wallet immediately on your social media handle. You'll be seeing the token you have, and if it's NFT airdrop, you see it as well. You can see by this side you see all the options. You can see this is airdrops. So if there's any airdrop you see it here if there is any nft or anything you see it on the social media handle you don't it don't, you must know it is li automatically linked to your wallet because that's why if you already have existing wallet just connect and log in not sign up but if you don't have you just need to sign up first well i'll walk you through the process of log uh, connecting your wallet now so this is the link i'll be using this my link to no i'm not using this browser i don't want a situation whereby they will conflict each other so let me use kiwi okay i will need stoic wallet stoic wallet is one of the wallets you can use to con connect your internet computer wallet so i can just decide to uh, here if i want i can just leave the social media handle i already have the wallets kept somewhere so if you want to if you have existing wallet but you, you have the phrase but you can't find the wallet anymore you can just import your wallet in uh, stock wallet you can import with your identity we have identity they will give you identity once you sign up the identity is like seven digits while the uh if you say import an existing wallet that one will come with phrase the phrase should be 12 to 18 18 words so it depends though when you are importing it on stock your wallet's my uh, words might be more than 12 but they will be asking you to import your 12 digits just import the 18 or the amount you have it will still work make sure there is no space at the end so to make sure it's good to it to work they will just ask you to change your password and confirm the password that's all so for those who already have existing wallet i will do this i'll paste the link i copied it will just be as if i've referred myself please don't forget to check the video description section you will see the referral id there so once you go there they say welcome to discovery this and skip top so you can see automatically they will give you your principal id so your principal id serves as your wallet address on the social media handle so that is mine that's for this account i have so now i want to log in this account that means i'll just follow just click on follow using your own internet id so i cannot follow when i don't even have a social media handle so if i should click follow now who would i uh, would the person you are following know that uh, just followed you they won't know they need the identity of the person so now i want to use in uh, should i use internet identity Mm, because internet identity is supposed to be something that is your is to, it should be known to you alone it's just like your key phrase so now what i'll do is i'll go back i'll go back then i'll click on login and now it will still ask me for internet identity okay no problem so once i come here now i need to impute my internet identity and when imputing my internet identity after imputing it i'll just click on start session i won't be able to show you because the internet identity is supposed to be confidential so i'll do that now as i said earlier the internet identity is a seven digits so once i'm done i'll just click on start session so i won't be able to show you everything i think one way or the other i may have uh i 
it failed to authenticate actually because I'm using the same mobile phone because it will recognize the identity of my phone already. It knows the phone I'm using for my wallet. So now using a second wallet, I have to use my phone. But for the purpose of those who don't have an account at all, so I'll just I'll just decide to just sign up a new wallet so that it will just take everyone. But if you already have an existing wallet, you just put the anchor, which is uh, 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 seven digits. You put it here, start session, then it will ask you to sign up. That means you now sign up. You put, you just put the username you want of your choice for for start signing up. Discover uh, that DS that social media handle. So now let me create a new identity. The device name now. Oh, mm, let me. I don't want to use the same device name. Okay, let me try and see. Not then. Create it's not my first time. So now I'm coming. Create a new device. Let me write let me note it pro. So it's not letting me actually it's not letting me that's one problem with icp they they notice everything so since they notice everything now what we need to do right now is oh let me just explain how these procedures work so once you click on internet identity after clicking on internet identity enter your anchor once you enter your anchor click on start session it's now pop up um sign up option just use the username of your choice once you use the username of your choice then it will it will show you to put input your email but it's optional if you like you put it if you like don't just just click on continue it will show you that your account is ready you just see your principal id immediately that's for those who have uh, existing wallet but for those who doesn't just come here just come here you 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 just impute this everything you it will ask you for it will just it will show you your key phrase make sure you save it somewhere it will also put the figure the anchor the anchor will be in number then the phrase will be in words make sure you don't join join them together anytime you're using phrase you use just the words anytime you are using anchor you use just the number so that's the difference. So once you set it up like that, after setting this up, uh, ICP wallet up, then you now create the social media uh, sign up. So that's how uh, it works. And even the problem is, you know, it's an internet computer platform. They dis they detect everything. That's why I had to use two phones then. So now I can't use the same phone I've used on this phone already. So there is no way you tell you are trying to tell them you have two identity that's what it means that's why it's rejecting me from signing up so uh that uh, this internet computer is like it's telling everybody that okay well, everybody is now known on the internet with one single identity there is no way except if you want to change your device and when you are changing your device you still have to sign up on that device with this anchor but you can actually use another one but if you use another one on your new device that means that's the only wallet you'll be using you won't be able to use the second one on the same device except you buy another device so that's how it works so i hope you guys get it so i'll be dropping the link for this now for you to use to join just make sure you follow me up on this platform so that we'll be working together if i see any airdrops coming up i will i will make sure i drop them so that every one of you on ICP can also uh, can also participate. So that it won't be as if um, the one just participating alone. So here, let me just go through it again. Uh, sorry. Oh. So here, as you can see, this is my profile. You see on your profile, you can see airdrops, profile portals, everything on the platform uh, so that means airdrops can come up at any uh, time at any point in time so here you see these are the nfts you check if you have any nft or something you can see you can join the portal in case for nfts showcase nfts you want to talk to people joined anything that has to do with all these nfts memes art box just join them if it means that's what will bring in what will be bringing news for us 
So that's cool. We join them. We don't get to miss anything. We don't get to miss anything. Join all the groups. Join. Did I join this? Yes, I did. Then just join all the groups you're seeing here. See breaking news. So probably we'll be getting news. Let me just check one of the news they drop. Breaking news. ICP swap on Twitter. Our devs are working with the ghost team to resolve this issue. Okay, okay. You just be getting news about ICP. It's still a cool one as well. So about the NFTs now. I want to check what is it they dropped lately. Let's see. Let's talk about the power to open this and that ghost. Let me just like as well. Okay, this is you can see this is the uh, uh, DSCVR airdrop bounties. So let's check so that let's see what it's about. If it's about airdrop, claim it immediately because once you claim it, it's entering your social media wallet. It will go and list on your wallet that you have airdrop. So it's not as if you need to be going to your wallet to check or something. And I believe from your wallet you can do you can actually send from this wallet. Okay, update. There has been a technical issue with the ghost scan. It's been working on. Uh, okay, all those things. I know once you get it, you you'll be going through some of these things yourself. So what I just want you to know is on your profile, as you can see, you have a wallet address. And when you have a wallet address, it means this wallet is connected to your what is it called? your wallet and if you have a drops click this sign that's where you will see where your air drops are this head this is a pig head i'll call it that's where you see your air drops if you have any so you can see it says wait air drop is empty i don't have any for now so they said explore all feed that's it will make you i think that's one of the things you need to do for you to maybe uh, get some air drop or something so you can actually just do that you go through the feeds if there's anyone giving free airdrops or some uh, airdrops for something you can just run it so that's how to go about it guys let's not waste, waste this opportunity i think it's a very good one so take care of yourself and i hope you enjoy and gain from this uh video thank you bye guys see you next time i'll be working on more updates once i get any i'll let you know so bye